now let us discuss about piggy backing let we have two missions sender and receiver we know that sender sends a frame to the receiver so after receiving the frame a uh, receiver provides acknowledgement for the corresponding frame but in reality what will happen is both sender as well as receiver sends the frame with each other so after receiving the frame receiver can also send a frame to the sender but here what will happen is the receiver has to wait until the next frame is available until the next frame is available the receiver will wait so let us assume that after some time receiver got that next frame so now receiver will sense its frame as well as acknowledgement for the previous frame so let's see what is piggy backing piggy backing is a technique of delaying acknowledgement until the next frame is available so here the acknowledgement is appended to the frame that is to be sent so frame plus acknowledgement will be sent so now uh, let sender receives the corresponding frame but sender also will wait until its next frame is available so let sender got is frame so now what the sender will do sender will sense its own frame as well as acknowledgement for the previous frame acknowledgement for the previous frame so now let receiver receives the frame but let us assume that receiver has no frame to be sent so now the acknowledgement will be sent why because here the receiver has no frame to be sent to the sender so it will sends only the acknowledgement to the sender so this is about uh, what is piggy backing so piggy backing means it is a technique of delaying the acknowledgement until the next frame is available so here the frame uh, the acknowledgement is appended to the frame a uh, acknowledgement is appended to the frame that is to be sent okay so why we are using this piggy backing here we are using piggy backing in order to utilize in order to utilize bandwidth in order to utilize the bandwidth efficiently let us assume that sender has 50 frames to send to the server likewise receiver also has 50 frames to send to the sender so uh, if if we don't use piggy backing then what will happen sender has to send 50 frames separately as well as 50 acknowledgements separately so likewise here also if we don't use piggy backing so piggy backing means both the frame as well as acknowledgement will be sent in a single step in a single shot so here also what will happen 50 frames as well as 50 acknowledgements will be sent differently so now what will happen uh, sender has to send 100 so 50 frames as well as 50 acknowledgements so likewise receiver also needs to send 50 frames as well as 50 acknowledgements so here the bandwidth will be more so if we want to utilize the bandwidth in an efficient manner then we we have to go for the piggy backing